Hello everyone, you're welcome to my channel Jam Vibes. Senzo Mayu was murder case in court is taking a whole different turn already. And of course, we are going to be looking at how Senzo Mayu's best friend Tumelu Madlala rubbished Kelly Kumalo's statement and described it as nonsense. That was a huge blow to Kelly Kumalo's face, most importantly. So do well to watch this video right up to the end so you get to understand everything that transpired. Before I give you all the entire details, kindly subscribe to my channel please, like this video, drop a comment and hit on to my post notification bell. Senzo Mayuwa's murder trial has taken another shocking turn after the late star's childhood friend Tumelo Madlala rubbished Kelly Kumalo's statement. Madlala, who is one of the state witnesses, recently rubbished the singer's statement during his appearance in court and uh, social media users have revealed that they are now confused with the statements. Many are calling for Kelly Kumalo to give a statement in person already because apparently things are getting so twisted in court on her side and her name keeps getting into the mud. Senzo Mayuwa's ongoing murder mystery had fans talking after state witness Tumelo slammed Kelly Kumalo's written statement. Tumelo rubbish singer Kelly Kumalo's statement in court. Kelly's statement actually read was read out sorry during the recent Senzo Mayuwa murder trial and Tumelo said that he does not recall what the MP singer narrated. And in the statement, Kelly Kumalo made it so crystal clean and clear that Dogozi Sitwala, Senzo Meiwa, and with himself Tumelo were actually at some point seen battling an intruder. And after Senzo started panting, there was a gunshot literally, then Senzo was all foiled with blood and stuff like that. And uh, what Tumelo actually recalls was that there was really no scuffle between Togo's Zitwala and any intruder because he said Togo is a very reserved person and not a fighting type. So Kelly Kumalo is lying in that statement and it is Arab nonsense. Also, Tumelo suggested that Kelly Kumalo should be brought to court to narrate how things unfolded on the day of Senzo Meiwa's departure from this world because right now he just feels like the whole narrative is definitely taking a whole different turn and uh, she didn't speak the truth in that particular statement except she has some very pertinent explanation that nobody knows about and of course she wants to speak about it. Speaking in the Pretoria High Court, Senzo Mayuwa's childhood friend and alleged best friend Tumelo said he saw things different from Kelly Kumalo's statement, completely different, in fact, far away from Kelly Kumalo's statement. And he added that the statement should be put aside and Kelly Kumalo should go to court and explain the nonsense she wrote. I'm stressing on the fact that he called Kelly's statement nonsense. Social media users have taken to Twitter streets to dish their thoughts on what Tumelo said. Many agreed that Kelly Kumalo should also be in court giving a side of the story instead of having a written statement. And if you ask me, I'm going to say that is the best of ways because I'm telling you all for a fact that Kelly Kumalo deserves to be there. Why? Literally, Senzo passed away in her mother's house in Fosturus. Literally, she had a relationship with Senzo Meiwa. Also, Kelly Kumalo has been finger pointed out already by advocate Melissa Latefo for being responsible for claiming the life of Senzo Mehiwa. Also, we need to remember that Kelly Kumalo has been cancelled on the socials already because people don't believe in her. So if she doesn't actually come out here in order to clarify her name, then I'm very sorry because things will get even more and more worse as far as time goes on. In more news about Senzo Mayuwa's murder trial, Briefly News reported that Kelly Kumalo's name is in the media for all the wrong reasons, again, following Tumelo Madlala's revelation that the star insisted on using Senzo Mayuwa's car after he was shot and his life claimed in a family home in Fosloros in 2014. Speaking during the ongoing Senzo Mayuwa trial at the Pretoria High Court on Monday, Tumelo Madlala said, the Mpini singer continued driving the late Bufana Bufana goalkeeper's car after he passed away, even after Senzo Meiwa's mother actually asked the question to Tumelo, why do they actually keep using Senzo Meiwa's vehicle, given to the fact that Senzo Meiwa is no more. Apparently, whenever she saw the vehicle back in the days, she actually just remembered her son and it was a huge blow for her, especially that she really didn't have time yet to grieve her son and come over it before, you know, these assets start being in use again. 
Malala, who was present on the fateful night, said the same vehicle was used to transport Senzo to the hospital and Kelly Kumalu said that that vehicle is the vehicle of the father of a child. So, by empirical means, she has all the rights to, you know, drive the vehicle whenever she wants. So, guys, I want you all to tell me in the comment section what you think about this. I love you from the bottom of my heart and do well to take good care of yourselves.